Uh, hello everybody, um, so, yeah, it's been a while since I made the last video, but, uh, I got a, another idea, so, you know, I'm back, I guess, and, uh, this one, if you can already tell by the title and the thumbnail, uh, this is gonna be another one of those drawing tutorials, this time it's gonna be for the, uh, the imposter from Among Us, right? Among Us, I mean... Uh, do I even need to uh, introduce it? Everybody, everybody plays Among Us. Everybody knows about it, even if they don't play it, right? The Imposter. I mean, everybody's seen the Imposter, famous, uh, famous, famous character. Um, uh, very popular in like memes and stuff as well. So a lot of people might want to, you know, know how to draw one for whatever purposes they might have. So yeah, I'll do that. This is just going to be in Paint, um, MS Paint. Uh, obviously, if you have a different program, that's probably going to be uh, a lot better. But, you know, not everybody does. So this uh, is kind of the most basic form that you can do, right? All right, so let's actually get started now. Um, I guess, yeah, I'll just do this sort of uh, line width. And, uh, yeah, so... To start off with, what you want to draw is this sort of, uh, okay, that's, no, not like that, okay, that's a bad start. You want to draw this sort of, um, yeah, this kind of shape, which uh, looks a bit, a bit like a tic-tac, um, you could say, I'll actually, I should erase a bit from the bottom here, because it's uh, not, that's not quite so good. Right, so this uh, sort of tic-tac, um, kind of half a pill or something shape, uh, obviously, I mean, this already kind of looks like a imposter, right, from Among Us. Um, so yeah, just do that. Uh, don't, uh, just leave this at the bottom open, don't, like, do anything here yet. Uh, then the next thing I'd like to do is do the eye. Um, or actually, you can do two eyes as well. Sometimes uh, the imposter has two eyes, uh, but I think one eye uh, is probably easier. I mean, I, I don't know. I'll just I'll just do one eye. It doesn't. It can be either one. It doesn't really matter. All right, just yeah, just like that. Again. Um, it doesn't have to be perfect. You could use the circle tool for this, maybe, but I'll just do it um, by hand here. Then, because um, they wear goggles on their eyes, or maybe uh, if it's just one eye, I guess it's just a goggle. So just do like a little uh, second smaller circle, or you could do a bigger circle, uh, obviously, than like the outside. Doesn't matter. Just have two cir. Okay. Just have two circles. That one, yeah, I, I messed up on that one. I'm gonna fix that real fast. Yeah, okay, that's that's better. That's better. So this uh, kind of circle on the outside of the goggles, you want these, um, yeah, these sort of rectangular things. Uh, I don't know what these are called, but yeah, they're uh, for attaching the strap. Which, um, which they're like wearing the goggles with, and uh, you can make this one like a bit curved uh, towards the edge, so it sort of looks a bit 3D. I think that's a nice little effect. So I'll just do it like that. Okay, and I mean, it already looks. Honestly, it kind of looks like the imposter. Um, yeah. Then, so for the eye. Uh, you can give him like a little bit of a different expression. I'll just do this one here, which is uh, this is like the eyelid or whatever, right? And then do the pupil like half covered up, just like that. Uh, then the or is this the iris? I don't know which one the iris is and which one the pupil, but like this part of the eye at least, right? Let's do it like that. Now he looks a bit annoyed, right? Um. After this, uh, I think, yeah, good good place to go is do the hair. Now, uh, the imposter in Among Us doesn't actually have, like, real hair. Don't, you know, it's going to look out of character if you draw, draw like, realistic hair. Uh, it's a cartoony game. 
and uh, they most of the impostors they just have three little uh, lines like that or sometimes two whatever just uh, this is yeah this is one way you could go about it at least uh, after that uh, it's probably a good place to go um, you do the arms and the arms they're just I mean just noodles basically right nothing uh no joints in these or anything just do like okay uh, actually i think the other arm we're gonna do a bit different I'm gonna hold this one up maybe do a little gesture or something right just like that so two arms here now uh the hands hands are difficult to draw right everybody knows that uh these guys they wear gloves and um, they only have four fingers. So these, you know, really more on the easier side to draw when it comes to hands. Just do another one here. The thumb always facing towards uh, the body. And uh, you know what? Let's let's give them a little, like, peace sign or something, right? Let's give them a little gesture. Just like that. Yeah. There's the hands. Um, yeah, and uh, I'll move it down a bit here. After this, what you want to do is um, draw their iconic, um, what is it, suspenders, I think? Yeah, th like their pants, basically, right? So do these little straps, one on each side, just like that. Kind of like the arms, just with uh, um, like sharp edges, I guess you could say. Right, they don't have hands on them, obviously. Uh, then on them you could do little, little circles, which which would be buttons, I guess. <clears throat> Excuse me. Okay, then um, that uh, which is the best way to go about this? I think. Now it's probably best to fi uh, continue the sort of shape of the body a bit further down. So just kind of see where this line is and uh, follow it down. Do the same on the other side. Just like just look around there. Um, and then um, next thing, just do a straight line between the straps. This is going to be like the actual pants part. Right, and then two lines that are right, curving outwards towards the edge. Oh, that one's wrong. That's that's wrong. It has to be here, right? Otherwise, the strap wouldn't be attached. Let's do it like that. That's perfectly fine. And then uh, this is like a second layer of fabric, I guess. Just this other, this other one, just just um, below it, I guess, right? Dude here as well. Yeah, this might be a bit tricky depending on where you place the hand, but just just about like there. Right, uh, and then you you know basically just want to give them feet, give them legs, uh, f finish up the bottom part, just a line like that bit curved not as curved okay that's yeah that's not good not as curved as the top part this is a bit um i guess you could say flatter so just like there now that's uh, yeah. yeah 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 okay yeah that's that's better All right that's good uh you could you know obviously do a lot better of a job at this but this is just for demonstration's sake really and then uh the legs of the imposter they are kind of sh very short actually and also strangely close together right i don't know if you ever noticed this but if you play among us a lot um like i do you kind of start to notice some sort of weird things with the game so just like that about it. yeah that that does it then they have boots on so don't worry you don't have to draw any toes on these guys 
just kind of like that. And the other one like this. And um, yeah, there's a few more things. But I mean, everybody, if you just do this, I mean, this looks like the imposter. Nobody can deny that. And for his face, uh, for his mouth, I should say. You can do a lot of things, really. I mean, you could do one that's like, oh, I'm I'm a little grumpy guy, right? Or you could do one that's like, hey, I'm a little, I'm a little funny guy, right? Um, per personally, I'd like to go if one that's just like, Ooh, I'm I'm all, you know, expressionless like that, right? But uh, I mean, do whatever mouth you want for your imposter. Maybe he's being sus, so he could, you know, make it a uh, sus and stuff, you know, Among Us and, and things like that, right? I play Among Us all the time. Yeah, uh, yeah, um, and yeah, we're basically done now. One optional thing that you can actually add to these which uh, is a bit more difficult and uh, more detailed. So we're actually gonna zoom in for this one, right? It's the little um, Among Us logo that some of these guys have on their, uh... is this an apron? I don't know what the f what this is called, but this kind of clothing that they have. Um, but yeah, uh, s to start off with for the little logo design, just do a circle again like this. Oh yeah, that's a that uh I was just gonna say that's a good circle, but then I messed it up. Yeah, it happens, it happens. Alright. Just uh, uh I've seen better circles, but you know it's it's fine. Okay. And uh inside the circle there is a um I guess a diamond shape. Right, so just do a few diagonal lines. Uh, they they should be touching the edges because this goes all the way to the um kind of border of the circle on all four sides. Right, this is a nice old diamond shape here. Uh, you can fill this in with black while you're at it. Just like that. Okay. Yep. Maybe better if you use the fill tool. I don't know. Bucket. Okay. And then from the, uh, from this, you want to start doing another circle uh, inside the diamond shape. But don't don't do a full circle. Just start at around uh, this corner or this. Uh, that's a bit further up to the right from the middle. Just start doing it. Start doing it like like there. Yeah, that's. That one's pretty good. You can uh, just kind of make this a straight edge kind of thing. And uh, yeah, then you just need to connect this with a line straight to the uh, rest of the black. And yeah, can you see it? It's a G, which stands for Among Us, obviously, Among Us, right? Uh, so yeah. Let's zoom out here, see the whole thing. That about does it for the lines. Now you do obviously want some color for your imposter drawing. And um, let's get the bucket tool for this. Make it nice and quick. Now, I mean, if you've played Among Us, and even if you haven't, everybody knows the imposter is yellow, right? Always yellow. So grab a yellow like that. Fill in these parts. Every uh, where we can just see the body with the skin. That's all yellow. Uh, don't forget this one, uh, so, which is like the eyelid. Um, then some black parts as well, which are these straps here off the goggles, and then also the gloves and uh, the boots. Just here. Okay. Um, yeah, next up goggles so just uh just do a little, a little gray i guess because it's metallic could do yeah you know what i'll we'll actually do this will be nice details we'll do some little highlights here so it really does look like kind of metal shiny metal right that's uh, optional though 
I would say um, next up again the bucket tool you want to give them their iconic blue uh, clothing pants suspender things and uh, it's you don't want to get a blue like these it's not very saturated and uh, this one actually looks pretty good for our purposes here we just fill in all of these parts this is uh, also still part of the pants and also the logo it's also still the same material uh, then is there anything left yeah the eye so the eye color uh, actually this can be a lot of things I think I don't know if all the imposters have the same eye color I think most of them probably have uh, brown eyes but you could do green eyes or if you want you can give them blue eyes uh, it doesn't really matter right people have all sorts of eye colors so it does the imposter but I'll just fill it in here with brown and then I always want to do this if you do eyes I'll zoom in so you can get a bit more precise do a nice little highlight here yeah just like that now it looks much more lifelike and uh, yeah I mean look you're telling me that's not the imposter that looks like the imposter right there if you played among us this is a great way to uh, to surprise your friends maybe I don't know uh, whatever you want to do with this knowledge I guess but yeah this is a it's just a short tutorial how to draw the imposter from among us uh, maybe you want a different tutorial on different characters from uh, other games or something you can let me know maybe I'll do a tutorial on those as well um, but yeah I mean I guess that's it right uh, if you wanna you can leave a like on the video I guess uh, maybe I'll do other ones in the future yep okay bye